everyone today I have another video and this is going to be another Lego gun video so if you guys remember this Lego gun which was very cool and very nice um and this one actually shot so that one this one is really cool and it looks very nice and um it has a bunch of other accessories and stuff um so if you want to see this video um I'll put that um I'll put a link in the description to this video so, um, that Lego gun was very cool, but, um, today we'll be focusing in on this new Lego gun I made. And, uh, this one does not shoot, but, um, it ejects shells, so, uh, that's pretty cool. Um, and, uh, one cool feature of it, which you probably just saw, is this whole top part moves, and that's how it ejects the shell. And, um, later in this video, I'll be showing you the mechanism, um, on how it works, um, and, uh, and if you just want to fast forward to that, um, I'll, um, I'll tell you when the mechanism part in the video starts in the description. Um, but starting off, I just want to do a little review of this. So um, starting off at the bottom of the handle here, this, um, this actually comes off um, like in my, um, other, my other Lego gun. The bottom piece comes off, and this is where you can get your shells. So uh, you can use these, um, the square ones, or you can use the round ones. I'll just be using the round ones just for now. Um, so that just pops out of the bottom with, um, these studs, with the one studs. So, um, that's pretty cool. And, uh, sorry about my light. Let's see if I can get that back on. All right, um, and, uh, so basically how you're gonna load it is you're gonna put a shell, whoops, uh, one second, that's kind of a malfunction with it. Let me get that out. Okay, so basically what happened there is, um, there's actually a little spot back there that these can slide into, so that's kind of annoying. But, um, going on, what I was saying is, uh, you put, um, a piece back there, and then you just move this part back, and then, uh, that has one shell in it right now, and then you just go, and then, uh, the shell pops out. So, um, that's really cool. That's one way of loading it. And uh, there's actually another way in the top here, which you just um, you just open that up, and then you can just drop the shells in there, and then uh, and then they come out. So that's very cool. Um, it's very nice just for playing. If you just wanted to play with it, you can. Uh, I got this the like idea from the um, Halo Five Magnum on how it goes back and ejects the shells and stuff. So um, that's where my idea came from. And there's also just a fake little flashlight that comes out in the front that flips out and is uh, on that part. And, uh, let's see. Um, and you can also, there's also some extra room in here, so you can also just store stuff in it if you want. So, um, that's pretty cool. Uh, that, because this doesn't take up the whole thing. So, um, that's pretty nice. And there's just rubber bands that make this go back and forth. Um, and, uh... And then the rubber bands are just getting held in the top, so it, like, automatically springs back. Or you can just go. Um, so whatever is easiest. Um, so, uh, yeah, now uh, I'll show you the mechanism and how this works. All right, so basically how you're going to get off this top part is you're just going to take these rubber bands off that right there. So uh, then it's unhooked, and then you just take off that like that and slide that off and now I'll get it ready to show you guys. Okay, so um, basically how it works, how it slides back, I'll show you that first and then I'll show you the ejecting shell part. So how it slides back is um, there's actually a spot right in there and uh, this just goes, this just goes right on the front here and um, this would normally just pop off. So uh, you're gonna take a piece like this and then that just goes under there. So uh, uh, that goes under here and then clips into this part right here. And uh, also since there's sides on it, it will restrict it so um, it doesn't go out too far, it doesn't fall out the back, and it doesn't fall out the front. Um, so that's how the sliding mechanism works. And then the rubber bands, all they do, they just make it so when you pull it back, it automatically goes forward like that, um, so you don't have to, like, go like that, um, but, uh, the actual shell ejecting part is probably the 
um, thing that you're looking for here is uh, get these pieces off just like that. Um, so basically how that works is uh, it's all in these little slanted bricks. So um, it's these right here. So uh, basically when you put the shell in in the front like that, um, they're, uh, actually I'm going to try and get a better view for you guys. All right, so with this side piece off, you can kind of see how it works. So um, when you put the shell in that way, there's, um, there's a piece in the back, and basically what that does is it pushes it into this, this um, parts of the slanted pieces, and then when it goes forward, this piece would be right here, so uh, you can tilt it and it won't fall out and stuff. Um, and uh, so then if you had, uh, if you had this piece in, like that so then once the shell is actually in there then since it should be on the top of the slanted bricks it just falls out so um there's no like thing pushing it out it's just the slanted bricks so that's basically the secret so um i'll show you again it goes it goes in like that it pushes it into the slanted bricks and then uh when you pull back this open slot makes it so it falls out and uh, you kind of need it at a tilt for it to actually fall out. So um, that's basically how it works. It's very, very easy. Um, uh, let me assemble this again. Uh, and you can make this basically any way you want. Uh, you can make it like a pistol. You can make it like uh, an assault rifle. You can make it look like anything. And uh, this, is, this is just, this is really cool. And um, it should, it's good just for playing with and as a model. So, um, uh, yeah, that's, that's, um, that's my shell ejecting Lego gun. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure to check out the um, other Lego gun video I made, um, which will be in the description below. Um, and if you want to be shouted out in my next video, make sure to subscribe and comment down below. I subscribed and I will, and I will subscribe right back to you and shout you out in the next video. So, um, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure to leave a like and maybe subscribe. Bye.